Hi friends, it's me, Miss Diane. Today we're going to read a story together, and we're going to sing a couple of songs. Some new songs that we've never sung together before. Well, the first song is about one of my favorite things to do. It's about riding my bicycle. Do you have a bicycle? Yeah. Do you wear a helmet when you get on your bicycle? I do. It protects my head. All you need to do for this song is to have two hands and make little fists like this. We're going to pretend like we're riding our bicycle. Can you do this with me? Good job. And this is how the song goes. I'm riding on my bicycle. I'm riding on my bicycle. I'm riding on my bicycle all around the town. I'm riding on my bicycle, I'm riding on my bicycle, I'm riding on my bicycle all around the town. My bike goes up, my bike goes down. My bike goes up, my bike goes down. Up, down. <laughs> Good job. I'm riding on my bicycle. I'm riding on my bicycle. I'm riding on my bicycle all around the town. My bike goes fast. Whoa! My bike goes slow. My bike goes fast. My bike goes slow. Fast. Slow. Good. I'm riding on my bicycle. I'm riding on my bicycle. I'm riding on my bicycle all around the town. My bike goes twist and turn and twist and turn. Twist and turn. Good job. I'm riding on my bicycle. I'm riding on my bicycle. I'm riding on my bicycle all around the town. All around the town. All around the town. Good job. Really good listening and singing. So I promised I was going to read you a story, and this is the book I brought with me today. It's called Gray Rabbit's Favorite Things, and it's written by Alan Baker. And he drew the pictures too, and they're really pretty. So together, we're going to look at some of Gray Rabbit's favorite things. One morning, Gray Rabbit could not find his favorite book. Look at all those toys. My goodness, he has a teddy bear and some blocks and a purple airplane and a red ball with yellow spots. Mm, but I don't see a book, do you? It's time to clean up, thought Rabbit. First, let's sort out the wooden animals. Now, let's see. Well, that alligator is a wooden animal, and so is this duck. And, well, the rat looks like a wooden animal, too. And so does this kangaroo. Oh, and maybe even that little mouse. Hmm. Let's see how many he found. There were two of each kind, just like Noah's Ark. But one thing was not an animal. What do you see in this picture that's the odd one out? Well, first let's look at the animals. We have two zebras, one and two, right there. We have two rabbits, one and two. 
two penguins, one, two, two kangaroos, one and two, two alligators, one and two, two ducks, one, two, two mice, one, two, and there's even two chicks. You see one here, the other one is hiding right over there. But what else in this picture do you see doesn't belong with the wooden animals? Look closely. Do you see it? Let's see if you guessed it right. It was the teaspoon. Good job. The teaspoon didn't belong with the wooden animals. So Rabbit sorted out his cups and saucers, but one thing didn't belong. Well, let's look at the cups and saucers first. We have a blue cup and a blue saucer, a green cup and a green saucer, a light green cup and a light green saucer, and a pink cup and a green saucer. I mean, I'm sorry, a pink saucer. There's a red tea kettle and a yellow milk jug. Hmm, but wait a minute, what is this? Does that belong with all the cups and saucers? I don't think so. Because it's a paintbrush. Hmm. So, Rabbit gathered up all his paints and brushes and made a useful sign. A sign that said paint. P-A-I-N-T. Paint. Hmm. Now what's the odd one out? I see paints and crayons. I see brushes and um, an easel and a canvas. All of those things are used for making art, but do you see something in this picture that you wouldn't use for making art? Hmm, look closely. Do you see it? A red ball with yellow polka dots, good job. You wouldn't use that to paint a picture, would you? Well, maybe. <laughs> it was the red and yellow polka dot ball. Rabbit found all of his favorite round things. Hey, stop rolling away. One thing did not belong. Well, let's look at all of the round things. I see a round red balloon and a green round tennis ball. I see a marble and some beads. And well, there's that red ball with yellow polka dots. But wait a minute, what is this? It's not round, it doesn't roll. I don't think it belongs there. It's purple. It's a purple, a purple vase. Hey, where can that go, thought Rabbit. It's the only vase I have. So if Rabbit had a lot of vases, he could put the purple vase with his other vases, but he doesn't have another vase. So instead he decided to match it up with all of the other purple things. The purple car and the clown, the purple sunglasses and train, the purple airplane and xylophone. And there's the purple vase, but wait a minute, what is that? That's yellow, it's not purple. It doesn't belong with the purple things. It's a yellow duck, that's right. Let's see where Rabbit puts the duck. Ah, duck. That belonged with the other stuffed animals. So Rabbit put them all together in a row. The duck and the dog, the parrot and the frog, the dog and the bear, all lined up. Hmm. Now what doesn't belong? What do you see in this picture that isn't a stuffed rabbit? Ah, oh, I mean a stuffed animal. Besides rabbit. How about right there? That's right, it's a green block. It doesn't belong with the stuffed animals. It's a block. Well, there were lots and lots of blocks. How could Rabbit sort out the blocks? They're all the same size and all the same shape. They all have letters on them. What's different about them? They're colors, right? Rabbit could sort out the blocks by colors. So first he built a square boop, out of red blocks. Then he built a wall 
out of green blocks. Then the yellow blocks made a tower. Wait a minute. What was that amongst the blue blocks? Do you see? Look, Rabbit's favorite book. I'll sort out the blue blocks, he thought, and then I'll read my story. So Rabbit took all the blue blocks. Wait till you see what he built. He built a chair for himself so he could sit and read. Ah, at last. <laughs> Looks like he fell asleep reading. Well, it does look like a pretty comfortable chair he made there. Ah, that was a great story, wasn't it? I really liked hunting and searching for things that didn't belong. Yay. All right, my friends, we're going to sing a goodbye song together. And we're not going to sing our cowboy goodbye song. We're going to sing a different goodbye song called The More We Get Together. But we're going to use our sign language words. So if you don't remember them, that's okay, because we're gonna practice them again together right now. So you need your hands and you're gonna take your fingers and you're gonna pinch them together like this. And you're gonna pretend like you're eating the skinniest sandwich you ever had. Ready? If you put your fingers together like this, this is the word for more. Think of it, pretend like you want more of a sandwich. You don't have enough, you want more, more, more. And that's how you can remember. The more we get together. Now, this is the word for together. Take two fists with your thumbs on top. Put your hands together like that. Pretend like you're stirring a big pot of soup. Let's all do it together. Ready? Together, together, together. The more we get together, the happier. Hmm. What's the word for happy? It goes like this. The way you can remember it is, pretend that you just ate a cookie and you dropped a bunch of crumbs on your shirt. But you're happy that you had your cookie, but you gotta brush the crumbs off like this. Happy, happy, happy. The happier will be. The next word is friends. We're gonna take our finger like this and pretend like we're making a fish hook because we wanna go fishing with our friend. We have more than one friend, so we need two fish hooks. So we're gonna go like this and we're gonna put our fish hooks together. Shoop. And then we're gonna switch, ready? Shoop. And then we're gonna switch. Shoop. One more time. Cause your friends are my friends and my friends are your friends. The more we get together, the happier we'll be. That was great practice. Now let's put it all together in a song. Ready? Here we go. The more we get together, 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 the more we get together, the happier we'll be. Cause your friends are my friends and my friends are your friends. The more we get together, the happier we'll be. How'd you do? Wanna do it again? Okay. We'll go a little faster this time. Here we go. The more we get together, 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 the more we get together, the happier we'll be. Cause your friends are my friends and my friends are your friends. The more we get together, the happier we'll be. So good. That was so good. Thank you, friends, for being with me today, for being great listeners and great singers. And I will see you again very, very soon. Bye.